Local Pulse with Big Hess. 6.52 and this is a remarkable segment because we have the man himself who is the most well-known person with respect to local yes, artists in the UAE. That's what you do. That's what you see and everyone knows you. That's the one thing I've learned. All the artists also know him. Who are you going to treat us to mm. today? So, so this week I kind of took it upon me to uh, discuss you know, the, the, the local, you know, definitely heroes but legends as well. So yeah. they're not up and coming. They've been doing music for 40, 50 years. Love. Uh, and just incredible. So we're talking about Amro Diab. His full name is Amr Abdel Basit Abdel Aziz Diab. Now I'm pretty sure Spectacular. 90% <laughs> of the pop, the, of the people did not know his full name because he's known as Amro Diab. Uh, the bell fell. The bell fell. Great. <laughs> um, that's how big he is. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> So, Amro Diab was born on the 11th of October, 1961. The oh, dude wow. looks like he's 20. I'm telling you. If you Is just really? Google it, he looks like he's 20. He right. never gets old. Uh, just wow. Um, he's an Egyptian singer, uh, composer, an actor. Uh, he has established himself an acclaimed uh, recording artist and author in the most Mediterranean countries, of course. According to research... He has created a style themed, and the theme is Mediter- Mediterranean music, a blend between Western and Egyptian rhythms. Is it Mediterranean music? Mediterranean. Uh, okay. Mediterranean. <laughs> Mediterranean. Mediterranean. <laughs> I love it. Uh, by 1992, okay, he became the first Egyptian and Middle Eastern artist to start making high-tech music videos. Facts. Right. Like, I was right. watching this dude, 1992, I was 12. Definitely remember him then. Okay. Um, when we say high tech music videos, you should see the music videos. <laughs> but at that point, very <laughs> high tech. They were great. Especially for Cutting that. Edge. Yeah. His 2014 album, uh, Shifted Ayam, peaked at number one on the Billboard World Album Child. Uh, again, Billboard World Album Chart. Wow. Number one. Right. So this is the Arab. You remember how I'm vocal about. You know, uh, 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 like most of the people I used to cover, I'm the one that kind of does their Wikipedia and like that because they have nothing written on them, right, you know. Right, right. So, 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 so it's still new. So yes. I'm just trying to say, like, yeah, this this dude has been working, and that's why, again, his album 2014 peaked at number one on Billboard's World Album Chart, uh, making him the first Egyptian and Middle Eastern performer to accomplish such a such an accolade impressive stuff um, but yeah this is incredible we're about to play his uh, song Tameli Ma'ak which is this is the music in the background um, but this guy is I met him once uh, one, he, doesn't, he doesn't remember of course we met him one like about like seven eight years ago um, very humble dude um, what's amazing about Amr Diab is that he is always a voice of the people and it's always nostalgic listening to him yeah. so think back to your boys let's say you grow up with Backstreet Boys. You become from a certain national, you know, vibe, um, and then, خلاص, you have fans on that. So anyone who's 80s and 90s is a fan of Amr Diab. If you're Egyptian, 95 percent or 99 percent, you're a fan. And we talk about Egypt, 102 million people. So wow, yeah, big, yeah. big population right yeah. there. Um, just a quick thing on his family. Actually, I, he was, like I said, born in 1961. Uh, he was born to a middle class. Uh, family um countryside uh and his father actually worked in uh, in, in 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 swiss canal uh, corporation and was actually the chairman of the marine um i'm checking in right here yeah at the age of six actually uh amro diab had his first shot at fame when he sang the egyptian national anthem biladi biladi which i know by heart i know the egyptian <laughs> anthem by heart don't ask me how but i know it um, at the annual 23rd July festival in Port Said, in the presence of uh, the, the the president, uh, the late president Jamal Abdel Nasser. Um, so, again, you see, as a result, he was awarded with a with a with a with a apparently with a guitar. <laughs> uh, I, didn't, I didn't know this from a guitar from the governor of Port Said, from from this like you know city, and began to become re- recognized nationally on a, on a, on a national level. He actually graduated with a bachelor degree in Arabic music from the Cairo Academy of Arts in 1986. Wow. He was wow. given a guitar. 
Um, um, I know, I was just thinking about that. It's amazing, and, and you can see it? now, this is a... And this is what happens. You know? Yeah. Uh, he, he has a very, like I said, unique style. They, they keep calling him as the father of Mediterranean music. Mediterranean. <laughs> Mediterranean. Put Ray in the middle. Mediterranean. Ray. What are Ray? Mediterranean. 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 There you go. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> that one. Uh, David Cooper and Kevin Dowie apparently referred to his music as the new breed of, uh, of, of Mediterranean. <laughs> <laughs> Come on! Just point at me when of, you need me to of, say of, it. Uh, you know, med, med, Mediterranean. That, okay. Yeah. And uh, you know, and uh, according to an author called Michael Frischkop, Frischkoff, uh, <laughs> I don't know his name, but uh, Amr Diab has produced a new concept of oh my god, Mediterranean, Mediterranean. music, especially with his instrumental hit Nur Al Ain, which we play right here yeah. uh, on 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 the show. Moreover, Amr Diab is known as a composer, having composed more than 97 of his own music. Um, he was one of the first singers to popularize music videos in the whole region. And that is a fact. And the first Egyptian singer to appear in music videos. So wow. the wow. first Egyptian singer to appear in music videos, to, to have the idea yeah. of music videos. So yeah, you guys, he, he is incredible. And with that being said, everything that I said to you right now with the legends that he is, Last year, something incredible happened. Okay. Um, so he's the number one artist in Egypt. He's been at it for years. So he controls that. He's the, there, there, there. He's on the top. Nothing tops Amr Diab. Right. He's worked with everybody. The dude is controlling everything. Okay. Last year, 22-year-old kid by the name of Wex, happens to be a rapper, kind of said, okay, uh, you know what? I've been working. I've been doing. And he has hits. Great, great social media following. Amazing online handling. Right. Guess what happened last year? No. He took over that spot and became the number one artist in Egypt, not hip hop, like Egypt. I remember this. And that for me was incredible mm. for me to see that happen mm. in Egypt. I still can't believe it. Yeah. You know, Wix is actually in the UAE. I've been trying to meet him, but he's like, he's celebrating his 23rd birthday. Oh, we um, think that's a baby. Which is really, yeah, baby. Right? Yeah. But he took over that. Like he used to listen, his mom used to listen to Amr Diab. 22 Amazing. years old so the fact that this happened for me it's a big indication towards it's it's doing it's doing doing really well yeah um and i talked a lot but we're about to have the news so we're gonna play the song after after <laughs> the news inshallah but Amr <laughs> see it's hard is, when you is, have a good a good artist Amr Diab is definitely a legend a legend a legend and he's called the hubba and every every one of you guys Give us 10, uh, give it two minutes, and then you're going to hear the song. Three, three minutes, three Let's minutes. Go. If you liked this episode of Yellow Home, drop a like and subscribe. 95. Be sure to follow us on Instagram for all our daily updates and top stories.